Hello and welcome today we're going to take a look at Fort Triumph. This game is available on Steam Early Access. Uh, it was originally a Kickstarter back uh, a few months ago, a successful Kickstarter. Developed by Cookie Byte Entertainment, this one is, is sold as a fantasy version of XCOM. Uh, the whole idea here is we have, like, you know, mages and, and archers and and, uh, and barbarians, and we're fighting against goblins and, and, all that, uh, and various other things. All very, um, very new XCOM style. And uh, the thing about this one that, that is intriguing, I've, I've played a lot of tactical combat sort of games here on the channel. The thing about this one is the um, the terrain is part of the part of the equation here. We can we can kick rocks, we can knock down trees, we can we can knock the trees over into the goblins. We can do all kinds of, of various things with the terrain that adds some uh, some interesting choices in the uh, in the combat. Anyway, let's go ahead and try this thing out. It came out on uh, it hit early access last at the end of April, so it's only been a couple weeks now. But um, let's jump on in here. There is only a couple of uh, campaigns at the moment. I haven't tried Fort Triumph Short War. Um, should we try that? Yeah, let's try that one. Why not? Uh, I tried the prologue before, which kind of gives you a bit of a tutorial and kind of runs you through the base of the game. But yeah, let's try this one and see what this is all about. On this one, on prologue, we're, we're killing goblins and things. There's various difficulty levels here as well. I'll show the options just to, uh, in case anybody cares. Um, there's really not much to it. Yeah, window mode. I think this is available on Linux, uh, I believe. Uh, don't don't take my word for it. Uh, anyways, I'll have a link below, and you can check the thing out. Uh, so yeah, back to Fort Triumph Short War. Sure, let's see what this is all about. The other one has a sort of campaign where we, we, we unlock somebody out of a cage, and then we go off and we try killing some goblins around this sort of uh, little village. And we go venturing into a cave. We'll see what this one's all about. Uh, Eleanor Grimebottoms. Please, Mercy, I don't want to die. Are you saying there's something wrong with being dead? Wait, are we the skeletons? Another death negative, bigot. Yeah, show him who's boss, Zaron. No, please wait, I have information about the breach. Stop this at once, Zaron. I'm sorry about him, he's having quite a mid-death crisis. I can help you, but you need to tell me what you want. What you know. Yes, I just apologize. Just promise to let me go if I tell you. I beg of you. Well, of course. Go on. A group of mages passed by several days ago. I overheard them speaking about a breach or a tear or excavation, something like that. Because mo come morning they headed southeast. Please, that's all I know. No, that's just what we were looking for. Now then, for your reward. Uh-oh. <laughs> See? Did I not tell you these dim-witted buffoons will fall for the good on the undead menace? Bad undead menace routine? Your work is a marvel to behold, sir. I'll be leaving immediately for Fort... The Fort Triumph Assault at once. You stay here, rally our forces, and follow suit. And as for this corpse, no point letting it go to waste. Oh my. Oh, okay, I see what you mean. I thought I thought we were going to have dinner. <laughs> okay, where, where where am I? Welcome, I'm Zaron, Junior Staff Supervisor of Regional Northwest Acquisitions. We decided to open a brand new branch right here in your neighborhood. I'll be showing you around. We're assigning you, that, uh, you to human resources. Get it? Just a clean, friendly joke to get us started on the right foot. Seriously, now I'm here for any questions you might have. I feel strong and hungry for flesh. Can I get a sword? Not yet. You start in the chainmail room, and from there you have to work your way up to the ladder. Yeah, okay, okay. Humor. Humor, yes. I sense a great disturbance. An evil pamphlet has been handed out nearly nearby. As always, I, am I the skeletons or am I these guys? No, normally I was these guys before. El, El the Jobless is her name. Uh, there's always great disturbance. This ominous signs with you. Maybe you're just having a migraine like the rest of us. My ability to sense evil pamphlets is second to none, I tell you. Something wicked is afoot. Relax, it's just probably just nothing. We've only been gone a few hours, let's have a look. Okay, so I am the, I am the good guys. Okay, I thought for sure I was going to be the bad guys here. Uh, okay, so here we go. So the game has, uh, well, it's very XCOM style. We've got a few different characters here. Uh, Clementine the Reasonable is our uh, our mage. She has a lightning bolt. Uh, she can also cast a whirlwind. We also have the ability to lift... And go into Overwatch. The ranged characters can do Overwatch, which we know what that is. Uh, lift is I can things I can do things like move boxes around. So say I'm, well, we'll just hopefully get into in a, in a place where we can use it, and I'll show it off there. Um, the other characters we've got L the Jobless is our archer. They have different names each time I play. Um, she has a grapple hook which pulls people closely. It's, the, there's a lot of tactical sort of planning that going into this. Uh, we've got Abigail Toad Odor. Mm -hmm. Uh, now, she has a kick ability, so she can say, say there's a goblin on the other side of this box, I, or same over here, I can kick the box into the goblin or whatever it is, and do damage to them. I can I can bash things around and, and do damage that way. I can also go into a brace mode. Um, and then we have Velvet Backstrong, my uh, my barbarian rogue sort of thing. 
Um, she has claws. She has claws, and she does everything else the other guy does. Um, yeah. Okay, so let's uh, let's move her up first. Sure, we have, so we have two action points. We can do one uh, up to here and then do an attack, or we can use both our action points to run all the way up. And um, if you've ever seen me play XCOM, we go all out aggressive. It's not the smartest move, but um, it always allows for some interesting things to, to happen. Our goal is to investigate the village. Wait, we don't know what's going on. We might as well just go cruising into the village. I'm sure it's all peaceful. People are just you know taking naps in the streets. It's a very ha happy place. Uh, you're my ar my archer. I'm gonna sit you behind this box, which is not the best cover, but it is a little bit of cover. And then my mage is gonna come and run up to here. And let's just see what's going on. All right. Um, I want uh, you to go first. So let's um, let's just go to uh, like this tree here. And again, you can see that. Uh, well, oh, here we go. There's the undead. Village now skeletons feel beautiful. Villagers appreciate. Appreciate if alive. We should search the mayor's house. My ranger senses tell me what's uh, that's where we'll find the nice stuff. We're not pillaging our clients' houses again. I bet we can still can earn the contract's reward if we dispose of the skeletons, though. I cannot banish my former friends and comrades. It's unbecoming of one who follows the codes. Technically speaking, we're releasing their soul essence from an eternity of enslavement. So barring your order demanding the guilt, your conscience may ease, rest at ease. All right. Um. Okay. So. So. Yeah, I was showing here. So the trees, like, everything has hit points. We can damage these things. So if we were to hit this pole, it would fall over and damage folks. Um, I want you to just... Um, just brace right there. That seems that seems okay. Archer, I'm going to run you... Oh, I can't run right there. That's a shame. Uh, we're going to run by this, behind this pole here. That seems safe, right? Yeah, that's great. Uh, stand right there and uh, shoot the first guy. 65% chance. You can see my bonuses and all that up top. Um, yeah, go for it, sure. Okay, is that the only guy in range? I'm gonna get the guy behind him, I guess, but no, we're not gonna do that. This guy. Just do a, uh, yeah, just do a normal shot. Four to six damage. There you go, nice, nice, very nice. Uh, okay, so, now my barbarian. I'm gonna just gonna run you up to here, just to get... Oh, you're not a barbarian. Wrong guy. Okay, well, barbarian! Um, I'm gonna run you, um, up to here, I guess. I just go here. They had this uh, this automatic um, attack opportunity thing, so someone runs by them. So, for instance, if I had put her in the right spot, like where here, no, well, she probably wouldn't have gotten an attack anyway there. But it would have been beneficial, more beneficial than it is now. So that's a uh, he's doing a brace move there. He's trying to shoot me. He is going to shoot me. Apparently, I don't know who he shot. Uh, okay, so we're not feeling too good. We could run. Uh, let's let's move her back. Can I move back behind this box, this very sturdy box here? Now, what we can try... There's no reason to do any whirlwinds. We're just going to zap this guy. There we go. One skelly down. Okay, now, can I run... Oh, I could just run over here and just destroy this guy. How much... He's got eight hit points. I can't do enough damage to kill him. But here's what we can do. Here's what we can, here's, here's the plan. Here's the plan. Okay, we're going to run over here. We're going to... Uh, you hush! I'm trying to kill skeletons. The damsel. No, it's. Oh, it's you. The four for one bargain guards when we contract them. I'm doomed. Yes, you are. Rescue Stevens. All right, Stevens. You shut up. I'm trying to save. I'm trying to kill folks here. So we can we can either lift this guy. We can like move him over somewhere else if you want to, or or we can kick the guy, which is what we want to do. Boof. So he smashed him into the wall, which took some damage, but now he's at a clear line of sight for our archer to go and do some archer things. He's also stunned for the round, so we're going to make sure we destroy this guy right now. Oh, he's still alive. Um, I could run up. Oh, here, I just run up. That's two points. I don't want to stop there. I'm going to get shot if I go there. Um, yeah, I'm going to get shot if I go here. So let's just... Uh, We'll just run up right here. Oh, here, we'll take this spot. It seems nice and safe. Just go there and uh, and just brace. There you go. Yeah, she's in trouble. She's in trouble. But not to fear, everyone else is going to show up. Uh, like, for instance, you are going to come up and stab this guy in the back. Smite him. There you go. That's Skelly down. Now, uh, it's now your turn. Um, 
Where is it? Yeah, you. I want you. Okay, so we gotta just uh, come in here. Can I get behind? I can just go here and shoot because then we. I'm gonna get in the way of anybody. I don't know if I provide cover. I'm not sure how that works exactly. Whoa! We found more. Um, I'd have a tiny bit of cover against them. Do we want to run and try to find someplace safer? No, you know what? We don't do that. We may die, but we don't do that. We stand and fight like um, like barbarians do. Okay, uh, I want you to get up to here and maybe get a shot. There are a long ways about there, but we can try to get a long distance shot here. We will level up in time and we can learn new abilities like fire arrows and stuff like that. We can, yeah, we can't get a shot on him. Uh, let's just go to a little more advantageous spot here. Can we get to... Oh, uh, yeah, let's just run over here. Okay, and uh, you... I'm going to leave you, like, here and put you on Overwatch. You're not feeling too good. Where's my Overwatch? There it is. Nice! Hey there. Alright, there's he's he's bracing for whatever. They will go into Overwatch as well. We have to make sure we, we watch them. Oh she, well, only one person actually hit her, so that's actually not too bad. She's still got five hit points. Uh okay, so I want you to go and uh Can I get a shot on anybody? You can probably kill this guy, can't you? He's got four hit points. You can do three to four damage. You got this? Bow melee attack. No, we're not doing that. Just you can do it. You can do it. Yeah, there you go. Oh, you did, like, stab him with your... You did, like, the whole Legolas stab with the arrow kind of thing. Uh, nice. Um, alright. So, I gotta move you up somewhere better. Let's find a better spot here. How about we go here? A little bit closer, so we maybe get a... Maybe get a shot on somebody? 17%. It's not very good. It's not very good at all. Now, we can do the whirlwind thing. Let's try this. Um, or we can try to destroy his tree. I can try to whirlwind the tree. Oh! Whoa! We did it! We did it! Nice. Okay, okay. Excellent. <laughs> uh, yes, we actually did something that we wanted to do. I don't believe it. Um, I want you to come over here, and I want you to, like, brace. Don't get too close up here, though. There's bad things around here. Uh, let's just brace. No dying for you today. No dying from anyone today. You hear me? All right, let's go back and uh, let's charge over this way. We'll sneak in behind this guy. Knock over some more trees. Where are you going, coward? I think it's Overwatch. That's what that is. I think that's what that is. Um, so let's let the ranged guys. What does that mean? Oh, that means you're in Overwatch. So you don't don't go there because you're gonna get shot. Oh, thanks, game. I appreciate that. I really appreciate that. Um, is he out of range? He is. So you know we'll overwatch him. Yeah, we can both do this. Um, we can go let this guy out. I don't think that's a good idea. I will get shot as soon as I step here. Anywhere I go, I'm going to get shot. So just just brace. He'll probably miss me, especially if I run with this guy, because I got pretty good cover here. Let's just get up to... I'm afraid I'm going to unlock some people. So let's just run up to... This uh, sturdy tree here. He's got a lot of hit points. You got nothing. Oh, no, you got nothing. Not supposed to be able to hit me up from there. Uh, well, it unlocks our archer. You can jump on top of the box if you wish. Yes, we do. Because that's the kind of archer we are. My name, El the Jobless, stands on boxes and blasts people. We could, You could yank him. If he's in too much cover, we could yank him out and let someone else shoot him. But she's the last in the round, so we're just going to shoot the guy. Might have been more ideal. Oh, there we go. Never mind. Might ideal to, like, to, like yank him in. The, the grab him, I think it pulls him one space uh, forward. Okay. So now it's just us. Um, hey, um, where's uh, Velvet? Velvet, come and uh, let this guy out. Stevens? Here for the timely rescue. My name is Stevens. I used to be a priest, but the town uses me as an accountant. I keep records of parchments, scrolls, books, and sometimes, uh, or sometimes on more exciting days, ledgers. Death and cage by mercy. Be mercy. Step in yourself. Oh no, they pushed me in. Who's in charge here? Let's see. The line of secession. The mayor was lost in the attack. His daughter is that corpse right there. The postman heroically died defending a package, and the royal dog ran off from the noise. Well, then, I'm the new mayor. In my first decree, a undead leader has performed 17 in infractions, including, but not limited to, horseback arson, murdering, yada, yada, yada. Dispose of him. 
Okay. Confront the undead leader. Leader. Um, Stevens must survive. Okay. Uh, we don't know where he is, but this is a bit more map. I'm guessing he's back here in the scary building. That's where I'd be if I was an undead guy. So, uh, well, we know where he is. We saw the uh, opening cutscene. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's just run up to here then. Should I leave Stevens with me? That seems dangerous. Oh, there's some more. Well, I don't want to go charging up there. I mean, I do, but we're going to try to resist. There you go, buddy. Um, do I stand on my box and shoot things? Can I shoot from this far? They're too far away. We can overwatch. They're going to run up here. Yeah, they'll. will they run this far up? Yes, they will, and we're going to overwatch them. Stand on your box and blast things. Oh, level up. I completely missed that. That's what you're trying to tell me before. Okay, so we do fire arrow. These are these randomize all... What? These powerful ra arguments. The ranger convinces everyone that she is a tree. Does not cost AP outside of battles. Does not cost AP to deactivate. Cannot use while burning. Target self. What does it do? It sounds amazing. So last time I had this, I had a choice between fire arrow and cold arrow. Um, I want to become a tree. I mean, this one's... The fire arrow is very cool because it burns things, and I really want to do it. But I want to do it, because I want to see what happens. Uh, so, Stevens, you have to live. you got six hit points. Just run. Um, I have a feeling someone's going to come from behind. But just stay back here for a bit. And you with your three hit points. Uh, hang out over here for now. I really need you to level up so you can get some hit points. Somebody drop a healing potion or something. There we go. Where's my, where's my overwatch? Yeah, I'll take one more step. You shot the box. I think, I think that was the box you hit. Okay, we got this guy under control. What we can do is we can come kick this guy out. Um, actually, we're going to do that right now. Come time the reasonable. Can you? Um, he's on a box right now. Can I kick him? Come up here. Kick the guy. Kick him. There you go. Oh, <laughs> okay, okay. Um, Archer. Just out of range. But we got we got plenty of people in in open line of sight here. So let's step to the tree here, and start mowing some folks down. I really what you um what does it do? I don't know, but I really want to do it. We're gonna continue shooting, however, because it seems more important than than tree time. There you go, very good. Um, mayor, just stay kind of close to us, but not close enough. Oh, you're a, you're a healer? I didn't even look at this. Okay, never mind, never mind. You have much... Whoops. No, that's not what I meant. That's not what I meant to do. We got, we got Clementine. Uh, and we have uh, Clementine. Who was that before? That was Abigail over there. Clementine. You can probably get to here and get a shot. Give me a... So we could try to get like a whirlwind in here and maybe push him around. Is he in range? It'll push him into the building. Not really what I want. I don't want that either. Um, lightning strike will do two to three damage, which is not a lot. Four to six on this guy, but it's not going to hit him. Yeah, it's fine. There we go. I think that guy. That guy did the uh, whole um, brace thing. Okay, so we can run up and hit this guy, but we will be way too vulnerable if we do that. So we're going to go and play it safe. Just for a round until we get some healing. Just step back over here and brace. I'm going to get you a heal next turn. Hopefully I can. I didn't use that guy's all his mana, I'm hoping. No, yeah, yeah, talk for, nice. Talk for opportunity. Yeah, that's right, buddy. Oh, he got, he got the box. Excellent. Okay, um, you probably need healing more than anyone else, actually. Well, you're a ranged guy. Can you heal anybody? What's the two mean? Is it like a cooldown? I fear it may be. Oh, no, no, it worked. Okay. What does that mean, then? I have two left? Um, can you hit some buttons if you stand here? Um, yeah, you gotta... He's got... He's braced, though. But we can try to, like... Whirlwind him away. That doesn't seem like a good idea. He's out in the open already, so there's no reason for that. Let's just blast him. Nice. Okay, now you. Let's come in back here. 
Get ready to go murder things with your claws in a minute. Um, this guy is braced, but we can kill him in one swing. We'll have this guy on the top of his next turn. Um, or, can we, we can't top a tree down. What's our plan here? If I stay here, I'll get shot and, uh, and hurt a lot. That's two. We can go to, uh... I don't want to die. Let's do it. Let's do it. Get in there, buddy. Get in there and kill him. There you go. All right. Yeah. Level up. Excellent. That's what we wanted. We got hit points now. Uh, healing or heals herself when surrounding and surrounding eyes when she kills an enemy, or proves accuracy of allies against enemies nearby the paladin. The closer enemies are, the stronger the effect. I like the sound of that one. She's always up at the front line anyway. Okay, Archer, right, so we gotta end this guy in one turn. We're not gonna be able to do it. Um, do we just do the tree thing just to see what it does? Come up here. And tree thing. Oh, you literally become a tree. <laughs> what is the point of that? Defense, I guess? <laughs> yeah, I got no no cover here. Okay, well, that was, that was useful. I'm glad we have a tree on our side. Alright, let's see if we can get... I can't get there in one turn. However... I might be able to do something here. No, because it's going to kick it into the wall here. It's not going to hit him. Hmm. I want to get over there. Can I go and... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Here we go. We're going to go here. We're going to kick the chest. There! No, 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 no. That's not what I said to do. No, I said, I said diagonal. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, come on over here. And we can see big man. Oh, oh, whoops. Let's see where the strike. I'm undead now. It's really a bit insensitive to some of our members. Some people are unliving. And the work is literally soul-sucking, repetitive, and unchallenging. But meals are free, and if you arrive before the crack of dawn and leave after sundown. And death insurance for your loved ones. We hold three meetings per day where only management speaks. Isn't that a bit much? No, no, it's the utmost importance. You can never have too many meetings. Vile fiends, your deplorable actions end here. Adventures, eh? Looks like it's crunch time, if you get what I mean. All right, so we got lots of bad dudes over here that we uh, we have just woke up. Um, so I'm, gonna, I'm not going to stand right there. I'm going to run you over to this. Oh, I can't reach anywhere. Um, come back over here. Okay, well, you're a tree now. What do you do as a tree? Trees cannot act. Stop being a tree. There you go. <laughs> okay. Um, I can shoot you for some damage. Uh, yeah, I, I'll, let's, I can probably kill you. If I can get a shot. It's a long shot. Let me hit the chest again. I think I have one heal left. Is what that, I think that's what that's telling me. Let's just run up to here. Save that one heal for uh, if somebody really needs it. Very possible that she will die here. I don't have sight really on anybody, so let's just run over to here. Okay, see what terrible things happen this turn. Oh, nice. That was good things. I always forget about a toxic opportunity. It's really nice for these ranged folks. Ah, there's Overwatch. Are you all going to overwatch? No, oh, you guys are... No, no, no. This video's already at 24 minutes. we got to speed this up. No, no overwatch. That's big man. That's the guy we got to kill. I think. Yeah, step. One more step. One more step. No. Um, okay, so we can go to here. Probably get a shot on somebody. We can probably zap. I can zap him and probably kill him. Let's do that. Just get him out of the way. There we go. Okay. Uh, did you level up? You did. What do you get now? Vortex draws units and objects closer to the center. And this one is blink. Teleports to an empty tile. Let's do the old vortex thing. That seems uh, exciting. Uh, and you're going to get overwatched if you move anywhere. So let's not do that. Um, just hang out. Over here. Yeah, don't do anything. Just, just, uh, just brace. You're going to do the same thing. You're going to be 
getting shot if you do any moving. So just, um, here's what we can do. We can actually, oh, you know what, let's try this. <clears throat> we haven't done any lifting yet. So let's lift this box and put it right here. There we go. So now we have cover. Some, a little bit of cover. No brace. Okay, can you get a shot on him? No. Um, you can safely move to here, however. And take a shot on... Yeah, take a shot there. I wish I got the fire arrows now. You missed. Uh, farmer. Can you hide out over here? You can't die. No dying, but you can give a heal over here to... Toad. Overwatch. No more of that. Ah, my box got... Yes, my box stopped you. That's right. I put that box there. Where are you going? No, no, no. The battle's up here. That's right. Okay, big... Oh, this is going to hurt. I hit you for eight without a talk... No, oh, man. Um, Archer. Do I, do I just shoot you from here? 29% accurate is not a good chance of hitting... Oh, who is this? This is you. Can we get somewhere a little more advantageous? No, we're gonna be we're gonna get hit by Overwatch if we do. Just just take the shot. Twenty nine percent chance. I believe in you. Ah, I shouldn't have those. Nowhere near him. Step on up. Um, can you pick this box up and put it? No, you can't put it over there. But you can put it here on that guy. There you go. Uh, yeah, go for it. We can kick him into the tree, which will do damage. But I think we just do damage. We just kill him. Uh, I'm unaliving again. Not that there's anything wrong with that. Look, the black magic that bound to the villagers' souls is fading too. Oh, they're all falling apart. Well, the undead have been dispatched, but Steven looks around at the carnage and dead villagers. I do not think we'll be receiving the contract reward for this. Again, we only have the guard village. Luck so bad. You believe this is to be luck? The town decides to save some coin and hire you, the least competent group of adventurers. What? And the very same week... The, in that very same week, a powerful necromancer appears. This is no coincidence. Someone planned this. There we go. We did it. We got some level ups there. Excellent. Can I do them now? No. We can go to the next level. Anyways, we're going to call it here, though. Uh, this is Fort Triumph. It is available on Steam now. It's, I'll, I'll have a link below. It's in early access. I don't know what the plans are for future things. Um, Zarn is defeated, but not without cost. Many of the villagers fell before the necromancer's forces. And your heroes can't shake the feeling that this is partially their fault. Downhearted, but not defeated. The party decided to head to the nearby tavern to lick their wounds and have a drink or two. Okay. Um, visit... Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, then there's spider... Oh, I haven't seen this any of this yet. Yes? I'm um, sure. Walk over to the tavern. I guess there's little things we could do here? These are beaters. I don't know what beaters are, but we're going to the, we're going to the tavern. Welcome, dull villagers. Tower Keeper greets you loudly. It's clearly need you clearly need to become better at hearing business. Sip of ale, yes. Um, oh, contracts. Okay, and we got a shop. We can buy things. We can recruit new people if we wish. Um, okay, okay, very cool. Anyway, thanks again for watching, and I will see you next time.